Hey guys, so I cocked up last week. I made a fairly nice Punisher themed key fob, but I screwed up the positioning of the ring on the casting tree, resulting in a failure. And I don't like failures. That meant I had to do it again. Sorry if that bores you, but the Punisher wouldn't quit, so neither can I. But one ring would be a bit lonely. So I decided to revisit a few other builds and turn these into rings as well. The Avengers coin was one I really enjoyed. And on the ring band, I thought it would be nice to include the arrow motif from the Avengers logo. I really enjoyed my Game of Thrones coin, but I fancied doing a bit of a revamp. And this is what I came up with. The problem I had was the band side of things. I wasn't sure what to do. Tell them the North remembers. Sorry? Tell them the North remembers. Well, that lot's not going to fit on the ring, but I can manage this. It's big, it's chunky, it's very northern and very House Stark. I did have a problem with a casting tree though. I made all these rings a little too chunky if I'm honest, but I like chunky, and there just wasn't enough side clearance for the Stark ring. So I centralised it on the sprue, a fairly unusual approach I know. The other two rings fitted below this, but only just. To be honest, I was less than half an inch away from the sides, so I expected a blowout. If you're wondering what these wax sprues are down the sides of the flask, you clearly didn't see my midweek video. Shame. 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 Well, I wouldn't make that much fuss about it, but it was a nice little tip for anyone using a solid flask. Now they're not looking too bad. There's a little shrinkage on the Punisher ring. The eyes are just slightly sunken. And you can make it out more clearly on this lettering. Look at the way he handles that cutter. That man's gifted. He's a craftsman. He's an artisan. He's, he's, he's an idiot. What a prat. Cutting right into the band, the dummy. Now I knew cutting into the central sprue was going to be awkward and time consuming, but frankly, I couldn't see the point now.
and just for a change, I thought I'd use some buffing compound. What do you think? Shiny, eh? I'm pleased with all three, but my favourite is the House Stark Ring. If I hadn't cocked it up, I would have kept it, but now it's going back in the pot. Shame! Now don't start that again. So lost PLA rings are possible guys. From a little imagination and a 3D print, to something tangible that can bling your thing. I hope you enjoyed seeing me have another bash at the Punisher ring. Take care and thanks for watching.